Down syndrome, or trisomy 21, is often referred to as the love chromosome. The condition is present in about 400,000 Americans. But as Q2's Asia Gore explains, a pair of identical twins from Broadview are one in a million, and they bring double the love. We knew we were having identical girls. When Jody Jansma got pregnant with twins, she thought the pregnancy would be typical. So when they were born, it was it was a shock. Holly and Mariah both have Down syndrome. So we had a geneticist come down from Spokane. He'd been practicing 38 years. He said you'd have better odds winning the lottery than you would having a set of identical twins with Down syndrome. The odds are incredibly low. Just 244 similar sets are documented around the world. Now at age 15, the twins are just like most teenage girls. They like taking <laughs> selfies. You may get selfies about this. And then turn about this. And then turn. Yeah, it's my life about this. And they have disagreements. Fine, fine. <laughs> The girls moved here to Broadview in 2010 after their mother met and married their stepdad, Mark. One of them's a little tomboy and the other one's pretty girly girly. He says the girls but have taught him patience, hand. unconditional love, even strength. Since birth, the girls have survived one medical emergency after another. Doctors say health complications are common in rare sets of twins. Recently, Mariah underwent hip surgery. Not long after, Holly suffered a stroke. Just blown away. I thought, wow, this is, this is happening. I have a little girl at home that can't even walk, but she's in a wheelchair, and I have to leave her to take care of Holly. It was just so hard. Despite days spent in hospital beds, hours in physical therapy, the girls stay strong. They'll whimper about boo-boos, but when it really comes to actual hurt, um, somehow they deal with it. Some days are harder than others, but every day is a challenge for this family when they overcome with love. The unconditional love they have taught us is just, it's hard to explain how much um, they've taught me. We tend to focus on things that we can't do anything about or change, and we need to focus on what gives you joy every day. <laughs> In Broadview, Asia Gore, MTN News. And Asia tells us she spoke with Dr. Roger Wallace at St. Vincent about these twins. He says fraternal twins with Downs are more common but still rare. If you'd like to donate to the Girls Medical Fund, you can click on this story at ktvq.com.